Windows Vista, is it possible to live on it in 2019? Probably you have already forgotten about an operating system like Windows Vista, and decided that she had long been dead. Certainly not. The most beautiful system of the entire family of Windows is still alive, and will receive monthly security updates until 2020. Despite the fact that most of the producers of programs and drivers refuse to support the system on it, you can work comfortably, if you have a good slism. Off it's no extended support for Windows Vista stopped April 11, 2017, from that date, no longer go out security updates for Vista. Additionally, Vista will not work as the focal point with XP, where it can be converted into an ATM machine, and get the latest batches for the ATM. But there is a Windows Server 2008 SP2, and has extended support ends January 14, 2020. That's it from this Vista system is able to use the update for itself. Vista operating system first came out January 30, 2007, and once failed to become popular. As of January 2019 Vista takes as much 0.58% of the market. Maximum 25% Vista had in October 2009 Boda. Windows Vista comes in six versions, from starter to ultimate. There was also a special version, Ultimate Upgrade Limited Numbered Signature Edition. This copy has a unique number and signed by Bill Gates himself. Just like expensive cars engines have a unique number and signature of the master, to collect it. Circulation exclusive was only 20,000 copies, probably more than Bill could not sign. If possible, use a Vista PC resources corresponds to the present time, 64-bit versions of business, enterprise and ultimate editions support up to 128 GB of RAM and up to 2 processor of as Nobni claims to Windows Vista are as follows. XP on the old program for a stream running instantly, but on Vista slower. But it was not the fault of the system, users simply have been too slow computers at the time, so they could not and did not want to sacrifice performance for the sake of beauty. Naturally, the demand for iron buyers during the exit of the system was considered too high in comparison with the old XP. The possibilities of modern computers far exceed the requirements of Vista, and now the launch of this system does not cause the desire to pull the cord and squeeze stekla. Bullshit number of older devices were not programs and drivers compatible with the new system. More stringent requirements for standard USB lead to incompatibility of the old equipment with the new system and update drivers Benmogolo. No nut, for example, the NVIDIA drivers released for a long time for Vista, flesh until 2016, while AMD has ceased to do so in 2013. Last NVIDIA video driver for Vista 365.19 WHQL from May 13, 2016 supports quite powerful even by today's standards the graphics card Force GTX Titan X. Force GTX Titan Z, Force GTX 980T and many others of that generation graphics and more street in Asmatria all the problems, the obvious fact that Vista has a beautiful, pleasant and attractive interface out of the box, without any third-party programs that modify the style of the windows. Compared with XP interface giant step forward has been made. So gigantic that conservative users have already appreciated the beauty and adopted a system with bayonets. Even now, the system is modern and attractive, and if you show a standard desktop in Vista and a 10 person is not familiar with computers, he just says that Vista is beautiful. The Vista was done fundamentally new kernel NT6 with a huge stepping stone for the future. This kernel is used today in Windows 10, Microsoft called it NT10, but in fact it is NT6.4.Sigidnya, in 2019 the system was not dead. Furthermore, updates are released regularly, supporting Vista's updated and safe condition. Well, not so much for her but suitable for her Tolko installed system can not simply be updated. Microsoft has decided to complicate the upgrade process so that users have been less tempted to use it. But for the fans there are no barriers. To run the built-in updates and are to manually download from the Microsoft Update Catalog and manually install 4 packages, KB3205638, KB4012583, KB4015195, KB4015380. Thereafter Update Center, you can run and install all that is there. Standard Update Center settings for updates offered only for Windows, so they should include a search for all Microsoft products. To do this, click the item Get Updates for More Products. Next, start Internet Explorer. There hang tick Acceptance Conditions and click Next. Thus it is possible to install all the patches released up to April 11, 2017. Then you need to download all the patches from the catalog of updates for Windows Server 2008 and install them. There are too lazy to download, at a forum MSFN have a theme Server 2008 updates on Windows Vista, it contains all the updates from 2008 for Vista in one package. 
the latest version of the Office Suite is supported by Vista Office 2010, so if you plan to use it, you can download updates for it through the Update Center. The whole 2019 will be released in update for Office 2010 and Windows Server 2008, and these updates can be installed on Vista. Install all the updates take a very long time, and this time you can save. On the internet you can find a ready image of Windows Vista SP2 with integrated updates via Puskit.Vihod 2019 Service Pack 2 is to make the system stable enough, a large part of the problem was corrected, and the stability was no different from Windows 7. It is through programs and drivers, optimized for Vista, Windows 7 start of cells exceeded OSD and IA.V network can find a lot of opinions about Vista experts as the most beautiful operating system from Microsoft due to the Aero interface, which was gutted in Windows 7. Collection branded wallpaper in Vista reached its apogee. After the wallpaper in Windows Vista began to deteriorate, decreasing in quantity and deteriorating caucused Vino.Not8 Vista supports many modern programs, although many of the new versions of them have not started. Let's see which of the basic programs that can stand in the majority of Windows users can run under Vista.Arhivator 7 zip in the latest version 19.00 running with no problems. The official reading and working with files. PDF Adobe Acrobat program has stopped supporting Vista. The maximum is only available version 11 Pro DC 11.0.23. Adobe Air Library also sees to be updated, the maximum available version is 29.0.0.112.A Here Adobe Flash Player is available in the latest version 32.0.0.114. The most recent version of Adobe Shockwave Player 12.3.4.204 works too. The latest version of the Diagnostic Utility AIDA 64 Business 5.99.4900 works without problems. The popular Google Chrome browser is not updated, the latest available version of 49.0.2623.112. Package Java libraries available in the latest version 11.0.2. Multimedia Driver Package KLite Mega Codec Pack is available in the latest version of the Microsoft. Net Framework Libraries are available 14.7.9. Program Night version 4.6.1. Microsoft Office 2010 Office Suite is available in its top versions 14.0.7229.5000, and you can be sure that the version will still be updated until 2020. Libraries Microsoft Visual C is available on all Internet Explorer browser version. Stopped at version 9.0.8112.16421 but it is enough to download other browsers. Mozilla Firefox is available only in versions 52.9.0. Free editing paint.net available only to version March 5, 2011. Switch layout Punto Switcher works in the latest version 4.4.3.407. Anonymous browser Tor browser, based on Mozilla Firefox is only available in version 7.5.6. Of course, it will not be all of the relevant assets of anonymity, but to change the IP is fine. File Manager Total Commander is available in its latest version 9.21a. Redactor Ultra ISO Premium Edition Disk Image is available in its latest version 9.7.1.3519. File Viewer Jvu Win DJ View is available in the latest version 2.1. WinRAR Archiver is also working in its latest version 5.70. Streaming Media Player VLC is available in the latest version 3.0.6. Camway Windows Vista can be a fledged operating system and a game in 2019, if you have the drivers for it for your device. Under Vista is available a huge collection of games under DirectX 9 and 10. 